Puppets are awesome. They help children learn really important life skills. We can address some really sensitive topics in a way that um, is non-threatening and is accepting. My name's Deb Ward-Lyons and I'm the Executive Director of Puppets in Education. Puppets in Education is a nonprofit organization based in Burlington, Vermont. Our troop travels throughout the state teaching children in grades K through 8 how to keep themselves safe and healthy and to appreciate each other's differences. We do this through engaging workshops and educational programs that use life-size puppets. Hey Eddie, get out of here and give me your lunch money while you're at hey, it. Robbie, I'm stop. It's not okay for you to take my lunch money. My interest was originally, um, really my interest was in helping um, stop the cycle of abuse for children. One of my kids were, um, a, were abused by somebody in our neighborhood. So I became like this mom on a mission. Um, I, I helped support my child and did everything that needed to be done to support our family and my child, as well as really thought how, how important, it really drove home to me how important it was. I didn't want this to happen to anybody else and that I figured puppets would be the most um, accessible way to get that information across to them. This is our 31st year. Um, we typically reach between 75 and 100 schools a year, over 8,000 students every year, and we have 23 programs. Even though we're entertaining and we're making kids laugh, we're using that to teach them important things about how to be empathetic and how to take care of themselves and their environment, how to take care of each other. When a child is in the audience and they're listening to this puppet character and role modeling this and explaining a lot of the same feelings that they're having also, um, they just start speaking right to the puppets and, and talking to them and telling their story. And as a result, over a six year period, we, we tracked our abuse prevention program and through offering 40 presentations for free to schools, we had over 90 disclosures of child abuse and domestic violence. A puppet is such an engaging character, much more so than just the teacher or the school counselor or the principal talking about issues of friendships. It just brings everything alive for children. Usually I talk about something like disabilities, or kids, different kids' disabilities, and also like how you can do that. I like how they always do a problem and a solution, or how you can, how kids are excluded and how you can include them or something like that. There's always a solution. When I look at them, they are so entertaining. I love how they always have a smile on their face and how every single show is individual and different. To be able to sit in there and then hear how the puppets talk to each other and then pull that out and give that language to kids. I think that's, we talk about things like bullying, abuse, um, health of the lake, whatever the topic is, um, how we communicate about it is the most important piece. That's how you deal with your problems. It's that communication piece. When children leave our presentations, um, one of my biggest hopes is that, is that they will leave feeling confident and sure of themselves to realize that they are awesome kids that are gonna make it in the world and um, people care about them, that there's somebody that cares about them, that they're not alone, that somebody um, has experienced or lived through some of the same things that they have and they're okay, that there are adults, that there are adults that care for kids and will help them. Maybe it's not the first person you talk to, but there is somebody out there that's gonna make a difference.